we are talking about wireless cards for laptops. Um, there are currently four FCC wireless specifications. There's A, B, G, and the newest one is the N specification. This particular card is a ABG card. Um, and usually, um, of those three, the BG specification is used most frequently. Um, and all the specification means it determines things like uh, transmission, transmission speed, uh, range, uh, things like that. Um, so when, uh, when considering wireless cards for laptops, I would actually recommend you go with the N specification. I don't have an example, but the end specification essentially uses um, uses the barriers that typically cause uh, cause transmission interruptions to actually relay this signal uh, off of those devices. That actually gives you a better range. Um, so if you're going to be looking to purchase a wireless card, go with a end specification wireless card because, in my experience, they have been better than anything else. Um, and what you see here on this particular card, you see the pins obviously where the device connects to your laptop. Um, but then up at the top here, you have two additional pins. Uh, these pins are actually where the power, uh, or actually the signal power comes from. Um, typically what you'll see is a white and a black cable that connect to these two pins. And these will usually run up the, up the laptop lid um, to give you your antenna, so to speak. Uh, and these are usually labeled main and auxiliary. Um, but those are the real simple components to a wireless card.